What is your thoughts on this whole Jalen Hurts isn't getting along with Nick Sirianni, and maybe they have a, a damaged relationship ever since uh, last season? I know how last season went. wasn't wasn't too great offensively. I mean, I guess it was. Rumor is allegedly Nick Sirianni will call out some plays. Jalen Hurts said, "No, nah, no, nah, we're going to do this my way." Flip the script on him, and it didn't turn out too well. We know the Eagles season didn't turn out the way they wanted to, as it did the previous year. What is your whole thoughts on the situation? And could you? Um, just enlighten us on like what the fuck is going on between Jalen Hurts and yeah, Nick Sirianni. I mean, is it real? It, it's real. I, I, there's no doubt about it that it's real. Um, Philly media likes to make the heroes of what should be our story the villains. So they're going to say Sirianni, bad guy. Bad Hurts, guy. Okay. Hurts, bad guy. Yep. I mean, you think about last year, A.J. Brown. He At uh, one point. This guy wants <laughs> out of here. This, this guy wants out. He has never been happier anywhere else than where he is right now. And great, that, great there. Even if he lo- loses eight games in a row, he loves Jalen Hurts, and I know he loves the system. Now, obviously, nobody likes to lose, right? Nobody. Uh, who would want to lose? But to kind of work off what you were saying, Sirianni and Jalen Hurts are polar opposites. Yeah. You see Jalen Hurts, quiet, soft-spoken. He goes out there, he plays football. Yep. You get Sirianni on the sideline, that guy's, bar- that, that guy's on the ground barking. Which I, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah walking, complete opposite. Walking through the chief stadium. Oh, Gary, no, Gary, no. Like, come on. Like, yeah, after they beat the Colts two yeah. seasons ago, that was for Frank. No, that was yeah. for Frank. <laughs> yep. So, I mean, you, you got to kind of take into, uh, take into effect that it's just two guys that they're not similar by any stretch of the imagination. But two thing, one thing that they both love. They love winning football games, oh, and yeah. that's all that matters. I mean, as long as you got two guys that love winning football games, they will have a working relationship. Um, it, it's really going to come down to the offense this year. Yeah, it, I would love to see the Eagles at least win a playoff game. If we do that, I think Sirianni stays. If we don't, I think he's gone. Um, Sheesh. I don't. I'm not a big fan of the talks of Bill Belichick coming in. I, that, that's what everybody's. I mean, if, every every team that has a coach on the hot seat right yeah, now, Bill, Bill Belichick. Yeah. Listen, I'm not trying to, you know, the guy's only going to be around for another five years before he croaks. I mean, he's 70. Oh God, she's a wigs. Hey, sorry about it. I'm just, I'm <laughs> speaking my truth. Like, I, yeah, I'm If just, it's your truth, yeah. you speak so it, brother. There's, you know, there's other guys in the system right now. Like, I would love to get that uh, offensive coordinator out of Detroit. If we could ben Johnson. Ben Johnson. But, but really, that's, I, that's as far as I look into the future. Because I do trust Nick Sirianni, Western New York guy. Oh, yeah. Town, New York. I mean, what? We, we'll be fine. That's that's all I can say about them. We'll be all right. All right.